Hi students, welcome back once again. Myself Shomiran sir, and today again I am here with your map pointing class on geography. So students, I hope that all of you have practiced the work or the map which I have given you on the last class. I hope that all of you have watched my video and according to my instruction you have practiced. I have told you to practice all the states, all the capitals. and the union territories which are there on the last video and accordingly i have given you some question with that video so student if you have already done the work it is very good if you have not yet done then you should do it as soon as possible and i have also given you my mail id on the last video so whatever you have practiced you can send your practice map to me through mail if you have any query you can ask through mail or from the youtube channel on the comment box you can comment and ask me about your problems i will solve it immediately so today we are back with the second part that is the solution of the question answer which i have given on the last video so i hope that all of you have solved but still if you have not yet or if you have any problem so again i am back with the question answer and the solving part so student this is the blank map which is required for your map practice the state divided map i have already told you have will take this state divided map and the color pencils which are required to color the states as well as the black pen which you should use for writing if you don't have the color pencil you can use pencil simple pencil for shading and writing but don't use any watercolor or any pastel color for pointing out the map or shading out the different states and the capital so one by one we will discuss about the question which we have given on the last class and accordingly i will show you the map and where you have to locate it so the first question is that which is the capital of india and locate it with red dot so what will be the capital of india what is the answer the capital of india is delhi or the new delhi so i have given number 1 new delhi and with that line i have shown it and with the red dot i have marked it over there so this dot over here it is new delhi so it will be the answer of the first one like this way you have to do it okay so this is new delhi so the next one what is the next question do yellow color on andhra pradesh so on andhra pradesh you have to do it in yellow color see this one is andhra pradesh okay previously the entire state is andhra pradesh but it has been divided now into two part this one is telangana and this area which are marked with yellow color it is andhra pradesh so i have given it number 2 and this is andhra pradesh okay the next question is which is the capital of maharashtra and mark it so what is the capital of maharashtra tell me the answer so the capital of maharashtra is mumbai okay so and mumbai is also the economic capital of our country or the commercial capital so here is the city mumbai along the coast okay and it is present in maharashtra this is the state of maharashtra the inter one if you want you can color i have not yet colored it so i have already point out it mumbai so this one is mumbai okay so this one is the answer of the third one next the fourth one what is the fourth question find and color it green on greenland sorry find and color it green on nagaland so nagaland is also a state of northeastern part so let's see where it is located so this is the northeastern part of our country and here i have marked it this is nagaland and i have given the number 4 and written so it is nagaland on light green i have colored it okay and this is nagaland so this way you can do it on your blank map if you have not yet taken you take it out and take out your color pencil and pen and after when i am showing it in this video you will practice it or do it or after that watching the video also you can do it 
the next one the next question is bhopal is the capital of which state so bhopal and colored the state so which state is bhopal is the capital of which state and where bhopal is located so bhopal is the capital of madhya pradesh so this one is madhya pradesh this is the state of madhya pradesh and i have marked bhopal okay number 5 bhopal uh, it is told to mark as well as i have also marked the state or i have colored the state you can also write bhopal along with bhopal you can over write over here madhya pradesh okay you can do it so bhopal bhopal is the capital of madhya pradesh and try to locate the city in exact position don't do that in the state wherever you like to point out you have given a dot don't do it try to locate it on exact location or exact position because many of the maps i have seen many of you have seen the map where i have find they have uh, marked the capital with the dot in any part of the state but it is not so wherever the state in the state wherever the capital is located or wherever that city is located you should mark that city properly okay next tip number 6 name and locate the union territory which merged to form one new union territory in the year 2020 okay so which union territory what is the union territory name that is daman okay daman and diu and dadra and nagar haveli these two union territory daman diu and dadra and nagar haveli these two union territory march together and form one new union territory called daman so this is daman given and here it is daman okay here is daman here is diu and just beside daman over here dadra and nagar haveli okay and all these have merged into one new union, union territory which is known as daman it is located along the coast of gujarat near the border of maharashtra and gujarat okay so this is a important question and the recent question okay and you should practice it properly the next one locate and color it orange the state of tamil nadu so you know you have heard about tamil nadu so where tamil nadu is located in the southern part okay this one tamil nadu written number 7 tamil nadu okay so i have located tamil nadu and where it is located okay colored the state this one is tamil nadu and i have marked tamil nadu and given number 7 so like this way you can write it down you can color it you can give proper numbering and if you don't want to number it directly you can do index also at the bottom of the map wherever the space is in the left hand side or the right hand side at the bottom of the map okay two spaces are over there from there also you can do index next one is mark and name and mark those union territories which are formed by the division of jammu and kashmir so you know that jammu and kashmir was a state but now at present in 2019 i have discussed on the last slide it become an union territory so jammu and kashmir become an union territory and ladakh so these are the two division in the northern part you can see i have given both number 8 okay jammu and kashmir this part and ladakh is the this part if the new map state divided map is available to you already this is divided the union territory are divided if you have the old map with you and if the part is not divided you just divide the part or draw the division or the boundary line and color it so this one is ladakh this part is the ladakh and this part is jammu and kashmir this one jammu kashmir and this one is ladakh okay so this is number 8 now the next question number 9 locate kolkata and in which state it is located so where kolkata is located kolkata is located on west bengal so locate i have located kolkata at the bank of river ganga okay so this is an important territory of kolkata capital of west bengal and i have also colored the state of west bengal many of you have done wrong this one they have colored bangladesh along with west bengal this one is an another country this is bangladesh so this part west bengal you should color it properly okay so kolkata is located on in west bengal now the next one the last question which is the largest state in india in 
size or area so in terms of area at present rajasthan is the largest state i have colored it rajasthan so this one is the largest state of india in terms of area and the smallest state i have not given the question why i am telling it the smallest state is goa where goa is located here the goa okay but as it is not given in the question you can practice it also okay so largest state is rajasthan in terms of area okay previously largest state was madhya pradesh but madhya pradesh was divided into madhya pradesh and chhattisgarh so after that rajasthan become the largest state in terms of area so these are few question which i have given 10 question i have given on the last video or the last class and this is the solution of this question those who have already done it if you want to have a self checking or if you have check yourself you can check it out from the video if you have done any mistake rectify it and do it or you can do one new fresh map after watching the video according to the guideline so like this way another task i have given on one map you should practice all the states and union territories and another map you will practice all the capitals of the states and union territories and after that this type of question pattern you will practice okay on the map so these are some sample question another video on the next class i will give you some more important question and i will also show you the solution so today uh, up to this much and accordingly you will practice so let's have a recap of the chapter what you have done we have already done about the states capitals and union territories as well as we have already discussed about it what are the states their capitals union territories their capitals some fact of union territory and capital i have already shared on the last video and some question which are given on the last class that question again on the slide it is given and from that particular slide from this slide you will learn this question and from the next slide you can see the solution of this question and you will take out the map and you will practice accordingly okay so and again we'll come back with some new type of question with some new interested topics and things related to this part so and i hope all you are well as well as you are staying at home so you should stay at home properly and prepare yourself all the chapters according to the instruction of the teacher not only this subject on the other subject also so you should stay home and stay safe thank you all and have a nice day